Here we are at 6921 Jackson Avenue in Hammond. Quiet block. Uh, roof appears to be older, but it looks like just a single layer. Appears to still be in good condition. Windows definitely, definitely need replacing. The front door also this whole little extension piece can probably be use some work on it actually. It's got a brick siding to it or a brick fascia siding. It looks like that needs work as well. Part of it's falling down. House does need a lot of work inside. Walk through the exterior. Vinyl siding, I'm sorry, aluminum siding on the side. Again, older windows need replacing. Vinyl siding could be painted, or sorry, aluminum siding could be painted. You have two garages here. One that looks like it's going to collapse, and then one that looks like it's a lot sturdier. We have to enter through the back of the home, through the porch. Uh, porch is literally collapsing. Uh, roof, like I said, roof appears to be in pretty decent shape. Walk into the home. We're going to enter to the kitchen. Okay, as we walk into the kitchen here, see it needs a, needs a lot of love here. Needs some paint and trim work in here. Basically a whole new remodel in the kitchen. Nothing really left to work with here. Yeah, the kitchen on this side and the dining area would be in this area right here as you can see windows definitely need replacing it's the basement walk to the left you have two bedrooms here you have a bathroom right out of the 60s needs replacing here older everything paneling even on the ceiling wow Okay, you walk into bedroom number one over here. Decent sized closet. Uh, needs paint, carpeting, or it actually has some hardwood flooring throughout the house, it looks like, but they put vinyl flooring over it. Looks like a bad spot in the vinyl flooring. Definitely need some paint work in here. Good sized bedroom, probably a 12 by 12. A little hallway closet. Walk into bedroom number two on the main level. Hardwood floors. In a bad spot. Probably can't be replaced. Smaller closet. Actually, goes in a little deeper. It's not. It's actually a good sized closet. Windows need replacing as well. Looking at the old cast iron piping. Water. Really dirty and nasty here. Okay, little hallway closet here, hallway linen closet. Go into the living room. Pretty big size living room here, probably about a 15 by 12. Good size. Whole house just needs patchwork and paint on the inside. Um, well, not just, but <laughs> for starters. As we walk here, looks like there's some termite damage here on the front porch. This is the entry door to come in. Looks like. Needs to be knocked down and redone again. Okay, then you walk upstairs. Walk upstairs and a lot of potential up here. You could probably add two more bedrooms. Definitely have a half bath. You have the plumbing up here already. So, it's kind of like a blank canvas here. Could be a master suite. Could be two more kids' bedrooms. Um... Possibly do whatever you want. You do have ductwork running up here. You have ductwork, you have electrical, you have plumbing. So, like I said, two bedrooms downstairs. You could have possibly a four bedroom home. All right. And then we're gonna walk down to the basement. Walk down to the basement. Really, looks like a lot of water damage throughout the years here. 
Somebody ripped the entire furnace and water heater out. Looks like we have some pretty recent uh, water in that corner there. Electrical is a 100 amp breaker. Um, this house would need a lot of work, a lot of work. Basement's a good size. I definitely recommend, you know, waterproofing it professionally with water drain tile system. But actually the wood beams and whatnot, it seems like it's structured really well. Got an iron beam running throughout the center of the house. Seems to be in good shape. It's just not an easy fix. This one's gonna need some time and some money. Like I said, two bedrooms downstairs, possibly two more upstairs. One bathroom here, one bathroom upstairs. Kitchen area again. And overlooking the backyard here. Older central air unit. And there you have it, 6921 Jackson Avenue, Hammond.